Improved your attitude, Angel? What do you want me to say? I was with Antonia the night she died, but she left the apartment, and that was the last time I saw her. Don't you walk away from me now, asshole! So your wife paid you a visit last night. What time was that? Late, around midnight, maybe. She didn't stay long. You're lying, Angel. You went after her. I think you killed her. You're out of your mind. My brother will tell you I was at home. I loved my wife. I didn't kill her. And what you think doesn't mean shit. So if you didn't kill your wife, who did? You better come up with something, Angel. This doesn't look good. Fuck you. I loved my wife. You're good, kid. You murder your wife and you just sit there as cool as a cucumber. What time did she leave? Maybe one o'clock. You and your wife weren't getting along. She was divorcing you. Is that why you killed her? We fought, yeah, but we weren't getting a divorce. I don't believe you, Angel. She'd been granted a decree nice side. She pushed you too far and you lashed out. I told you. I wouldn't accept a divorce. She was my wife. Things got bad sometimes. But nothing would have made me want her dead. Nothing in the world. You didn't want anyone else to have her. You didn't like the idea of other men fucking your wife. Them slipping it to her. The idea that she might like it. Vete tomar por culo. Easy there, angel boy. Ease it back a notch. You deny killing your wife? Of course I deny it. Why would I kill my woman? When we found your wife, her jewelry had been removed. Was she wearing her religious medallion last night? Sure. She always wore that. I think you killed her, stripped the body of jewelry, and then went back to her apartment for the bracelet. You should get a better hat. The sun is getting to your head. I've told you the truth. You don't believe me? You can go to hell. Looks like somebody broke into her room and stole her things there, too. Why'd you do it, Angel? What the hell are you talking about? I was home with Hippolito. Your wife has been brutally murdered. So how do you explain your shirt being covered in blood? You found that? I cut myself shaving. You're lying through your teeth. You killed her and your brother's in on it. You don't know what you're saying. Why would I do that? Hippolito's my brother. But he would never lie for me about killing Antonia. He knows he'd go to hell for that. We're typing the blood, Angel. It won't look good if it matches your wife. As God is my witness, I didn't kill her! Keep it to yourself, kid. Let it eat away at you like poison. You're going back into a cell. We'll be waiting when you're ready to spill your guts. Are you taking my wife's murder seriously? Any ideas? So... Fruit market was the last stop off Antonia made. Let's go. You could go to hell for all I care. So, your wife paid you a visit last night. What time was that? Late, around midnight, maybe. She didn't stay long. You're lying, Angel. You went after her. I think you killed her. You're out of your mind. My brother will tell you I was at home.
We have a witness who confirms that you are arguing, that your wife ran out, that you followed her, and didn't come back. I know this looks bad, but it's not true. We argued, all right, but she went out, and I went out after her, and she jumped in a car on the corner. There was a car waiting for her? Can you describe the driver? Not the driver. It was too dark. But the car, it was a brown Ford Coupe. You and your wife weren't getting along. She was divorcing you. Is that why you killed her? We fought, yeah, but we weren't getting a divorce. I don't believe you, Angel. She'd been granted a decree nice side. She pushed you too far and you lashed out. I told you, I wouldn't accept a divorce. The judge had set a date. You were going to be paraded in front of the whole city for your cruelty to her, Angel. Antonia. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> she came in drunk, out of her mind. She doesn't normally drink. She was looking around in her bag. Said she wanted to serve me papers. Me, her own husband. So I slapped her down. She ran out. That's the truth. What size shoe do you wear, Angel? Size 8. What difference does that make? When we found your wife, her jewelry had been removed. Was she wearing her religious medallion last night? Sure. She always wore that. What about the charm bracelet? Was she wearing that? You know about that? She never wore it. She didn't like the message. She kept it locked up in that box of hers. Don't you walk away from me now, asshole! Quit staring at me like that. Your wife has been brutally murdered. So how do you explain your shirt being covered in blood? You found that? I cut myself shaving. Angel, I'm not going to waste any more time on this. Give me something or I'm going to have you charged. My brother, Hippolito, he said some bad things about Antonia last night. So I had a sock him one. We got into it. Keep talking. She said she came from the El Dorado bar. And? It's not one of my places. We used to buy fruit at the market down the street. But the creep there was always running his eyes all over my wife. What's the name of this fruit market? Just picked fruit. Ord Street downtown. One last question, Angel. Do the words kiss the blood mean anything to you? No. Sounds sick to me. You're not in the clear by any means, Angel. You're going back into a cell. You should think about whether you have anything else you need to share with us. I'm stumped. Ideas? So, the fruit market was the last stop off Antonia made. Let's go. No more. I've had enough. <laughs>